Welcome to technical drawing. Today we'll draw this sum. Now in this first we will draw axis. Let's say this point is O. So we'll mark O and this is P which is in this same line. But now we don't know this distance O to P. But we know this distance full this that is 140. So 140 is done. After that, this is how much? 25 and 50. So I'll take 25 and 50. And I'll draw a vertical line. After that, this circle, radius 12. So from O, I'll take radius 12. And this point is radius 24. So from this point, R, we can draw radius 24. Now we need to draw this radius R45. So if you see R45 is internal to 20, sorry 12. So 45 minus 12, how much it would be? 33. And it is touching this line. So it should be parallel to that line at 45. We need to draw a line parallel to this line which is 25. So I will take 45 and I will draw parallel line. See this. See this. This arc and this radius 12. So 45 minus 12 is how much? 33. So from O I will cut 33. So I did 45 parallel line and radius 33, wherever it will cut. Let's say that is point A and from point A I can draw 45. This is done. Now we need to draw radius 25. Radius 25 is external to this radius 45. Let's say this is point A, right? So from A to this point P, it would be how much? 45 plus 25. And it will be on this same line, right? This line. the one which we drew from O on that line. So from A, we'll cut on that line 45 plus 25, 70. So we got point P and from point P we can cut 25. Now if I want to know exact point so then I will join A to P.
will say this radius 10 which is external to this radius 20 and this point is also important this point let's say this is x see this this radius this point x this is important so we'll mark x over here this is how much 35 so from this line from that 25 mm line i will take 35 mm and i will draw a vertical line then if you see they have given radius 15 so i can take 15 15 i can draw a square of side 15 and i'll get the center point See this, radius 15. Then you extend this. Now they have given radius 20. So how much you have to go up? You have to go up by 20. So take 20 in your compass. And from here you can draw radius 20. Let's say this is point Q. Now this circle, radius 10, which is external. So from P I will cut 25 plus 10. And from Q I will cut 20 plus 10. So you'll cut 35. Sorry, 30 from Q and from P you will cut how much? 25 plus 10. Wherever it will cut, from there you can draw radius 10. Now we don't know where exactly it is touching. Where exactly it is touching. So then we can draw that line from P and Q. And we can draw radius radius 10 from the respective point that is s you can join ps and sq also the, now this arc 85 is internal to radius 24 so 85 minus 24 61 so you'll draw 61 from r and it should be parallel to this line 85 mm right so you take 85 mm and from this line where we have taken 50 right we'll draw a parallel line And from R, you cut 61. Wherever it cuts, that is point, let's say B. And from point B, you cut radius 85. you extend this line so we are done with this sum thank you